Chad opens the barn at 5 a.m. Cindy works the land her grandfather plowed. Stan calls them his girls. And Allie just likes to feed the calves. These are the farmers of Prairie Farms Dairy, bringing you the farm fresh quality your family deserves. And we pledge not to treat our cows with artificial growth hormones. We are Prairie Farms Dairy. From our family to yours, farmer owned Prairie Farms. Hi, I'm George Bremer of the Herald Bulletin, and this is your Colts Midday Update. This Colts update is brought to you by Stoops Buick GMC of Muzzy. Stoops Buick GMC is proud to celebrate 25 years of serving East Central Indiana with a large selection of new and used cars and trucks. Come see why Stoops is a better car buying experience every time. Visit StoopsAuto.com. It's a rainy day here at Anderson University with the walkthrough being moved indoors for the first time this year. It was a big problem in 2012. About seven walkthroughs ended up in O.C. Lewis Gymnasium. Today, however, not much of an issue. It seems like everybody got their work in on schedule. Josh McNary now up and fully participating with the team. He says he, we believed he was going to be brought in as a pass rusher. He says he's working at middle linebacker. When you get a look at the guy, physically, he reminds you a bit of Notre Dame's Manti Teo. Should be interesting to see how he can do out on the field. He was in full pads yesterday with everybody else. All 90 men are now up and ready to go in practice. The Colts are heading towards a preseason game on August 11th at home against the Buffalo Bills. Once again, if you need any updates, you can go to www.haroldbolton.com or follow me on Twitter at GM Bremer. This Colts update was brought to you by Stoops Buick GMC of Muncie. Stoops Buick GMC is proud to celebrate 25 years of serving East Central Indiana with a large selection of new and used cars and trucks. Come see why Stoops is a better car buying experience every time. Visit stoopsauto.com.